Hey guys, welcome back to another Starters video, and in today's video I am playing the Munificent Destroyer. It is part of the Confederacy Independent Systems in the Star Wars Tech Tree, and it is a very fun ship to play at low tier. It is the beginner. As you can see, it's located here up the Star Wars Tree. You don't have to go very far to grind for this, and it's the first thing that you go before you go grind off all the tier 3 ships. Now as a tier 2 ship, end of the line tier 2 ship, it means it is very, very powerful in instances. Now, what makes it very powerful is the heavy prow cannon and it sits at the very front and the ion prow turbo lasers that sit at the front of it too. This big looking gun here has a 47 and a half kilometer range, which for low tier is really, really good. Especially with its reload and its amount of damage, including the, the uh, ion cannons here, the ion prow cannons, which have another, it's 45 kilometer range, which is also really good. Now, it does mean those are really the only things doing damage and then the rest of your guns, which are the light ones here, sitting along the bottom here, only have a 32 kilometer range, which ain't great, but because they are small cannon hybrids on the CIS, they can be turned into point defense, meaning this thing can defend itself from carriers, which is insane for low tier. It's really fun. And recently, it got a remodel from Josh. Josh is one of the developers in this game. We all love Josh because this remodel is awesome. It's even got a hollowed out bridge, like some of the SBY models. This is, this is really nice. I really like it. It's very nice. It also has a very, it has the classic CIS uh, engine sound, which is, I, I, you can't really describe it until you hear it, but... It, they basically made it louder, which is just cooler, and all the other CIS ships don't have that, which is weird. But, on the other hand, I know for a fact Josh is making more CIS ships. He's come out with some a leak of one. But there are probably more that he hasn't made yet. The rambling, let's get into it. What better map to play this on than Coruscant? Doesn't it sound amazing? Also, I do appreciate that people are complaining about spawn capture on Coruscant, which is <laughs> quite funny, because uh, it, it's Coruscant, you can spawn right next to your enemy, there's no real spawn camping on Coruscant. <laughs> Had to quickly change teams because the uh, enemy team decided to uh, not exist anymore, and that's the Star Destroyer. I'm gonna die here because I'm the only one spawning in. <laughs> I switch. Oh, there is one guy. You do have a decent amount of health. 30,000 on the shield. When you come across Star Destroyers, they typically have a bit more health than you, but don't really matter. I'm getting through his health. Getting there. He, yeah, he's, he's mostly gone. You also have really good angles, gun firing angles on these Prowler cannons, which is really weird because they are technically frontal firing. They look like they'll frontal fire, but I can like look all the way down like this. It's very funny. You do have no missiles, which is a bit of a problem. Can I quickly mention that the CIS starships, they have this like armor plating on the outside, and when you actually look inside, it is very weak in here. You can see why in Star Wars lore the Munificent is extremely cheap to manufacture because it's basically, it looks big and menacing from the outside but in the inside it's just hollow basically with a few weapons and that's about it so I find, just find that quite funny. You know people in low tier have a problem of just, just not spawning in or leaving. I'm the only one. I switched teams now I'm the only one on here. Now look turn to point defense mode send those forwards oh, the prowlers won't hit him he's too fast and too small uh, that would leave me quite vulnerable what is going on here what is that are those parts of my ship that just flew off what <laughs> I don't know I don't know what those are. Let's just make him get closer, you know. Let's just, let's just, let's just taught him to come closer. Yes. 
something bad will ever happen to you. Why is no one? It's four people on my team. Someone joined my team. They're not spawning in. It's just me and this goddamn expanse ship. He's killing all my fucking. Uh, it's all fun games until I shoot down mostly missiles, isn't it? <laughs> we the plan worked. The plan worked. It got too close to the sun. <laughs> yeah, you can see the uh, ion cannons and the prowlers make quick work of their shields, and that's their shields gone. Oh, he's trying. To... <laughs> you, you, you can't shoot through a solid object. He's, he's fixated on that guy. He hasn't. He just he just noticed me, but he missed. Oh my god, the comedy! I switched teams because none of my teams spawn in, and now that's just happened to the enemy team. You know, I'd be I'd really be playing musical chairs with this one, switching between teams. But let's just watch this rebel ship just get all his health completely melted. Yeah, yeah, it's 15,000 damage on your first hit. And he's barely scratched me. He barely scratched me. He's getting melted. My teammate spawned in. And any minute now. It's because he's so thin, though, that probably the power cannons are actually missing. Because they do have a dispersion rate on them. Which is quite funny. Meaning, I think most of my shots are missing and. That man be dead. He be gone. Wait. Are they from here? Yeah, Josh, look. They're from here. They're falling off. <laughs> when I said these are cheap to make, the munificence are cheap to make, I didn't mean the things would just fall off it as you fly along in space. <laughs> He's not having a nice time. He's engaging the expansion, but I just knocked out his entire shields and... Um, that man gone. I don't know why I'm switching to point defense mode. <laughs> Literally none of these guys can do anything to me. It's just funny. The Munificent is the definition of someone who's got pretty much every shipping game is now just bullying anyone who goes in the low tier. Which is cool because it's funny, ain't it? Now, there, now doesn't that look like a familiar sight? He's missing. How's he missing? I'm stationary. <laughs> I'm not even moving. It's just the aura I have. The absolute aura. That they miss every shot. What is that? And that was a Municifant. If you enjoyed this video, comment down below what you'd like to see next. Remember to like and subscribe. The Municifant, very fun, as you can see here, score, very fun ship to play. In low tier servers, when the server's a bit larger, it, obviously it won't just be, you know, repeatedly spawn camping, but it's still a very fun ship to play. It's just that it is a Wednesday more Wednesday afternoon, so a lot of people are at school, so the mid tier and low tier servers are quite dead right now. But yeah. I'll see you next video. Goodbye.